Well, hello there, and welcome to How to Doodle Man with me, the Doodle Man. Today, we will be doodling a jellyfish. When doodling a jellyfish, you will need a piece of paper, a pencil, and a pen. But we won't use that pen straight away. Instead, we shall be starting with the pencil. Use the pencil to create a large circle at the top of the paper, but not too big to leave room for dangling tentacles. Now, a silly sausage to curve beneath that circle. This will create a nice beanie jellyfish shape for us. Now, some sausages will dangle down beneath this shape to create tentacles. You can draw as many as you like, but I usually draw three. It's a magic number, you know. Now go back up to the original circle and create a circle within that circle and yet another circle within that circle. This is the eye of the jellyfish. I like to make one eye but you can have as many as you like. I'd recommend no more than 842. It's time to get your favourite pen and start to bring this creature to life. Create an outline all around the creature. Follow the pencil line on the outside of the basic shape. Woohoo! Are you having fun? Now work in that same technique into the central eyeball and fill up the pupil with glorious ink. Carefully add extra lines over parts of the jellyfish body and also the tentacles in order to create wrinkly shapes. This will make the creature more of a convincing creation. How about some twinkly eyelashes as well? A few more wrinkles and ta-da! It's a jolly little jellyfish. Creativity is important when doodling. It is always fun to experiment with your creation. How else can a jellyfish be doodled? You can exaggerate the features we have created. Here are some jellyfish I drew earlier. A square-eyed jellyfish. A square-faced jellyfish. A flat-faced jellyfish. An extra-long jellyfish. A wobbly-bobbly jellyfish. And a big-headed jellyfish. <laughs> what a bonkers bunch. The jellyfish will be lonely by himself, so I've put mine into an even bigger doodle. Now the jellyfish can make friends and swim freely in doodle land. Wonderful. Thanks for watching. Have a doodly day.